what's going on? So the second recipe that I wanted to throw at you guys was how to make homemade hummus. Just because you got the gorgonzola beans, which have um, carbohydrates, protein, fiber, and then we have the healthy fats from the olive oil. I mean, it's it's a win-win all around. So here's how it's done. You're gonna wanna get a blender. I'm using this Vitamix right here. I've already thrown in two cloves of garlic. Then you're just gonna take chickpeas straight from the can, toss those guys in. And what I did was I saved about a third of a cup of the liquid from the can. And I'm gonna throw that in too. And we got about a fourth cup of olive oil. We're gonna to toss in what's called tahini, which is just pretty much ground sesame seeds, which will make it nice and creamy. We got a half cup of that. And tahini is something that you're gonna to wanna to shake in whatever container it's in before you use it. Then we got the, we'll do the lemons next. We got juice from two lemons. So you can just take the same uh, colander, crush up your lemons. Then after you get all the lemons in, then we have the spices and we'll do one teaspoon of cumin. and then half a teaspoon of salt. Throw a little more cumin in there, why not? So you can place the top on, and then we're gonna take this guy. If you don't have one, I'm sure you'll be able to figure it out with your blender, but we're just gonna Pretty much throw it on about medium. And you push it down every now and then just to make sure all the beans get crushed. That should be just about good. So a nice way to prepare it Let's say if you have like people coming over and you want to make it look nice. Wow, look at that. You can actually put it in like a little plate and then cover it with some parsley and some paprika. I'll show you what it looks like. So you can put it in a little bowl like this. Nice little presentation. Good for like two or three people, I would say, but the entire batch should last you all week. Uh, it can go with like carrots, celery, chips, whatever. Great snack. I know I eat it every single week, but those are the two fats I wanted to show you guys. One was avocado based, one was olive oil based. Um, get your fats in. And remember they come from other things too, like seeds, uh, nuts, salmon, like you saw in the video. But hope you guys like these uh, recipes. All right, and I'll talk to you later.